Hello everyone. Um, this is CC here and today is Monday, um, um, October 15th and I am 35 weeks today in zero days. Um, I'm just doing this little video because I really don't have anything to report. Nothing's different. Same cravings, same everything. Only thing is my feet are swelling right now because it's morning. It's not really swell. They usually get swelled around nighttime. Um. Oh, I put together a video yesterday. I was supposed to upload it yesterday, but I was cleaning so much yesterday that I didn't get a chance to upload it and edit it and things like that. So I did it just now, and I'm going to just attach it to this video because I really have anything to report. And. I have a doctor's appointment on Thursday this Thursday, so I think I'll make a video on Friday about my baby shower plans because if the doctor doesn't tell me anything abnormal or different, I'll go ahead with my plans to my baby shower, so I guess I'll just make a baby shower getting prepared for my baby shower video or something like that. Um, thanks for watching, you guys, because after this video, that'll kind of be it. Oh yeah, I have to do a belly shot. I'll take a picture and upload it. Because I don't feel like... I didn't bring my, my camera stand out here. So, see you all later. And thanks for watching. Bye. This is CC coming to you with a mini baby haul. I have to sit down. <laughs> okay. So, this stuff is what you see right here. And this thing that is on is a changing table. It's all raggedy, but it works. <laughs> um. So, this is the... Uh, things that I have so far for my baby Brayden that will be here in November okay so we're gonna go through it one by one <clears throat> this was given to me by my niece and it is a, a a tub like you put it inside the tub and you lay the baby in it and then you just bathe them and everything so basically yeah it was in still good condition because she barely ever used it so I have it this is, I don't really know how this worked because I was babysitting my friend's daughter and I put her in here and yeah, I think it's just a thing that you just put in bed and then you put the baby in the middle and that way they can't roll over or something. I don't know, but it didn't work for her. This goes into, I'm sorry, y'all need a chair, hold on. Okay, so instead of standing up doing this, I'm just going to grab this. Okay, first let me tell you. These two bins that I have, I got them from Big Lots, was I think $4 each. So I have this to put his stuff in. Certain things that I have that don't have like a place or anything, I just put them in here. Alright, so toothbrush, which will go inside my, diaper, my, ba my bag, my hospital stay bag. I bought, actually I got this from Big Lots and it was like a dollar for toothbrushes. So one for me, one for my boyfriend, one for my daughter. And we'll just have an extra. I really, I really, really, really wanted this thing um, to put on his diaper bag. Like when I'm out in places, it's very handy. And I had these when I was pregnant with my daughter, when I had my daughter, but um, they didn't have this handy dandy little thing. So hopefully they upgraded that. So I saw it in the store and I just bought it because I saw it. <laughs> um, pacifiers. These was actually given to me. Well, actually, I bought these from Kmart. And these were given to me by my sister-in-law after I bought these. <laughs> and then she gave me two more, which is the exact same ones that I bought, which they were in the package, but my nephew came over my house and he opened the package. So, they're open now. This was something I bought to keep my um personal things and my daughter i thought she opened my front door my bad so yeah i just bought this you put your toothbrush in here since my daughter's going to be there my boyfriend i put a toothbrush in these three and then i can put like my deodorant or whatever in here and then whatever in here i it was a dollar at big lock so i bought it since i didn't have a bag this is um wash I mean I didn't wash anything so 
it still need to be washed but this is a blanket this is things that my niece gave me a bath blanket some towel rags um washcloths for him um burp cloths receipt or this is two this is a receiving blanket birth cloth receiving blanket receiving blanket birth cloth receiving blanket birth cloth and receiving blanket and receiving blanket and this would be just a regular storage bin that I just keep around for him to put things in so this was one storage bin. By the way, I'm going to stand him buy a um Starlight sterilizer and sterilize all of the pacifiers, especially the ones that are open. So yeah, that's what I have for him. And this bug, buggy bed thingy, and then this one I have a hand-me-down wipe warmer and see it didn't tell with a monitor, and this is the base for the monitor. And these are the plugs. Oh shoot, sorry. For these two. This um when I was at my doctor's office, the lady from Healthy Start was there and she gave me this baby bag. And it's so cool because I I I mean it'll probably just be like a backup baby bag or something. But if it opens up like this, let me open it this way. And then it has a, like a little changing pad. Isn't that cool? I was like, oh, that's so neat. <laughs> so, and then you zip it up right there, and then you zip it up on the other side, which I probably can't do because I can't only have one hand. And then you open it, and it has like, like they have this onesie, which is huge, <laughs> and it says, "Eat at mom's." <laughs> And on the back, it just has a plate. Please place me on my back to sleep. Tell me, tell me to play. Basically, they're just promoting that kids should not sleep on their um, stomachs to sleep. And it has a little rattle with Healthy Start. Well, of course, other than 90 days, and it's just a little rattle. And then it has papers and pamphlets and like, informational things that I do from my reading. Well, eating for two and all kind of stuff. Oh, um, just like all kind of samples and things of that nature. Just all kind of stuff. So yeah, that's all that came into this little bag that she gave me at my doctor's office one day. Okay. So this, these are the the newborn things that I have when I will wash as soon as he gets home. I mean, this will basically be the clothes he has for when he gets home from the hospital. These are all hand-me-down. Some are bought by me, but majority of them are hand-me-down. All right, so this is just a regular little t-shirt that will go under a onesie or something. This is a onesie. Kevin Klein onesie that my niece gave me. More Kevin Klein onesie. Hold on. Kevin Klein onesie. Another Kevin Klein. I don't even know if he had this many. <laughs> um, some shorts. Some more shorts. By the way, this stuff has not been washed yet. In the front window. Like moving from the wind it's so pretty outside so y'all can see this is outside my window it's like so pretty and this, the wind is blowing nice little so my boyfriend was on we'll watch well we we'll have went to the beach or something all right so bib oh backwards it says i love my mommy mommy <laughs> This is what I bought when I first told you all that I was pregnant and it's just the little bib. It says thank heaven for little boys. Um, more bibs. Bibs. <laughs> bibs. Bib. 
bibs, bibs, and that's a hat. I love my big brother. He doesn't have a big brother, but we'll still wear that <laughs> hat. Bib, bib, hats, and bibs, and another hat. And this is what I bought when I told you all I was having a boy. And hat. Hat. This hat, I doubt he will ever. Sorry. This hat, I ever think he'll ever get to wear because it doesn't snow here and it doesn't really get that cold where he will need that hat. Another Scully. Hat. Hat. This is a cute little vest my niece gave me and I don't know what a shirt is right now but it does have an inside shirt that goes there. There's some little cute little monkey pajama, I mean pants and another Kevin Klein onesie and <laughs> just another little onesie but it's long sleeve so you know it'll be cold around that time when he come home. And mommy loves me. A hat to go with, I think, those or something. These are like booties. Oh, they're one of the pool booties, actually. I didn't even open them yet. I didn't wash none of this stuff, so that's why I really don't really know what's in here. More socks and, oh crap. Um, hand muffins, mutton, mittens, I mean. And we have shoes that my niece gave me, little sandals, and then more socks, 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 and then shoes, and then that's it. So this is all the stuff he have from when he come home from the hospital. This is all newborn. Go check in there. Newborn bibs and hats and socks and shoes. Now, ouch, this stuff. Oh, my feet stuck. Ugh. This stuff is zero to three months. There's more. So, I'm not going through all this stuff, but it's more clothes. So, I'm sorry, this is in the way. It's more clothes in here than it is in the, the newborn clothes. So, I think I'm buy like two more like newborn outfits. Because it's going to be Thanksgiving and then he's going to do pictures. So yeah, that's it.